back, everybody, to Advent of Ascension 2.1. Oh, got you there. Uh, we updated. I think you guys know we updated. I don't know. It's been we've been updated for a while. And uh, what was that noise? I just heard some some snarling. What's going on down there? You scrubbies. Uh, we had a problem with Mine Factory. Uh, so I wanted to help Dakota do something. So I got this block smasher right here. And I placed it over there to help Dakota clear an area. What the fuck? And it crashed the server. And we couldn't get back in this area of the server. So I had to reload a save. Ow. And uh, so we lost a couple things. Not really. Because we went into the world. and Because we're able to go into chunks that aren't this chunk. And we came in here and we were able to uh, save a bunch of our inventories. What the hell happened here? Is this a floating ruin? No, it's not a floating ruin. But yeah, we are able to save our inventories and stuff. And uh, we didn't get set back too far. Well, there was a couple things. Uh, that might have disappeared that I don't really care about. But yeah, I've been working on this right here. I've been working on a rail system to go to Dakota's house. And uh, we're using these vertical rails from Railcraft. And this should be dope once we get these powered and going. Uh, I'm going to see what I can do. I think I want it to end up all the way at the top of there. But I don't want to use nothing but vertical rails. So we'll see what we'll get going here. I'm using this wooden platform because it's easy to make. It doesn't look good. But uh, I'll find a way to add something colored this wood. And we have it right here. It's creosote wood. Kind of hard to make. Not really. But uh, yeah, that's that's what we got going on. And uh, sorry if my brightness is all messed up. Because I updated my computer to Windows 8.1. And I don't know. I feel like my brightness went down. I don't remember how to turn up my brightness. Either it's my monitor or it's actually like my display. Because everything is so dark and I don't know what to do about it. But yeah, check this out. You see this right here? Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. Alright, so this is the... Okay, what was that even? If I wrote it, like... This is uh, Bibliocraft. You can put custom paintings in Bibliocraft. Let me show you. Uh, in here, you can put custom paintings. This is all I put. I could have put something else, but I'll restrain myself now or now. Uh, and you can do stuff like that, and I'll definitely get some things in here. I don't think other people can see it, unless I put it in, like, the server files. And, uh, it'd be dope, because I can mess with Dakota. Oh, God. Uh, but yeah, that's dope. I'm just gonna take that down for now. I just wanted to show you guys that. Can I place it without the frame? No, you can't. You have to place it with the frame. So, I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff away. We are gonna be talking about miscraft in this. I wanted to do an episode with Dakota, but I don't have that much time. And by the time he's ready to go and he gets on later, I don't think I'll be able to play. Uh, or at least record. But, I wanna do some things with miscraft. As you see here, I have a bunch of pages from miscraft. And uh, I'm not really gonna go, I guess I can go over the basics. But I'm not really into the two advanced things about miscraft. Uh, but let's check this out here, hold up. Does this have power? Did I power this yet? Yeah, I did. Okay. Uh, so, oh yeah, and let me show off this up here. I don't think I showed this off. I mean, the upstairs area going all the way up to. Da -da -da -da. And I'll do some working stuff around there. Don't worry, we'll be getting more into Advent of Ascension. Like, we fought a Smash lap last episode. But we're still trying to gather up some, like, basic materials and stuff. And trying to level up our Hunter skill, which went down a lot. I think I had mine, like, 18. But since we had to reset the world because of that crash. Uh, uh that happened so basics of miscraft you get the ink vials and make the ink vials fairly simple uh put them in here then they put paper in the bottom you get these link panel pages uh to make a linking book do i have a linking book let's make a linking book this is this is what you need if you go into one of these if you go into one of the ages you make one of the worlds you make you're gonna need a linking book to get back out, or you can never get out again. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can never get out again. Maybe you can go through another portal, but I'm not even sure about that. But yeah, if you do this, say, hey, where do I wanna come back? I wanna come back right here, boom. Now it's green, overworld, I'll come back right here if I use that book when in there. Uh, like I said, I'm going over the base, I'm not trying to explain too much. You can also make custom books right here. Uh, I have strongholds in this book. I have gold ore blocks in this. Stone beach biome. And yeah, this stone cold gold is what I named it. And uh, you can customize, customize your your books. 
That or you can just generate completely random ones. Let me show you one of the completely random ones I generated. Uh, so we'll hop into this. This is one of them that I generated. Very purple here. It's always nighttime too. But that doesn't mean that this isn't a good world. I kept this world specifically for one thing here. And that is the coal clouds. There is straight up clouds just made of coal here. They look like clouds. But they're just like floating platforms made of coal. And what's not to like about this dimension is a bunch of coal. There's also a bunch of structures that can generate. There is specific structures from Miscraft though. They look like houses. Like cobblestone houses made out of stairs and stuff. And that's where you can find special special pages. So let's... It's very important. So I can either use this linking book and go back to the overworld. Or if I brought one and then put it on a book stand, I'm pretty sure it's infinite. Actually, I don't know about infinite, but if you use a linking book without having a book stand, it uses up the book. So that's what I've just been doing. But I bring an extra linking book just in case. Uh, let's make sure all my skills are good. Now here's two trash dimensions, and then here's this one. This one actually looked pretty cool. It was like an underground world. Uh, we got cave world, score surface, spontaneous explosions, called Tiger Bomb. Okay, now this this one right here. This stone cold gold. I'm scared to go in there. It is fucking it's a nightmare dimension but there's so much gold look at this what's even happening in here this death is happening in here that's why it's bad but check this out if I, if I can actually teleport oh god this is not where I wanted to teleport see I burned to death there's like the just when you go to Caillou temples that's what's going on here ah right, here we go so here's these like golden, beautiful golden clouds. Oh my god, so beautiful, am I right? I don't really need gold to be honest, because I already mined a bunch of it. But yeah, uh, I'm out of here. <laughs> that dimension is nightmare. Is a nightmare, not is a nightmare. But yeah, I have a bunch of gold now, thanks to that dimension. Uh, gather those, might as well. <laughs> uh, so we're set on gold, we're also set on coal. I've been set on coal. Charcoal too. Uh, and yeah, that's like the basics of Miscraft. Now, what do I want to do with Miscraft? Is make a place where we can set up quarries to mine. Now, we have water box loaded. We have cave world. Okay, just like cave world. What else? But we're gonna go to Dakota's uh, place because he has a pretty nice world, a fairly tame world. I do have a couple of tame worlds there, uh, but. So far, I've been lucky just finding stuff inside his. So we're gonna go into his. Uh, it's like a weird end, end stone one. But yeah, let's see if we go here. This one. It's cow here. Uh, we just we good. All right. Let me show you the uh, houses how they look like. See if I can spot any on the map. Because I went to two of them here, and I've just been collecting the pages. All right, that's what they look like. This is what we're looking for. Things like that. I found that one, and then there's another one somewhere. There's a bunch of other structures, but I don't know if they're from Miscraft or from just like other ruins mods we have in here, because we have a bunch of ruin mods. But yeah, let's just get the hell away from all these guys. We, we got this troll basher axe, man. This thing, this thing hits hard. And I like it. Oh, God. My game was spazzing there. But yeah, you can get really, really random worlds. Like, we can get... I know there was one of them with lunalist grass in it, and also... Like a uh, Christevia, which is a uh, upcoming dimension. There was a like, Christevia cobblestone there, and uh, it was really, really weird. I, I didn't like that world because it gave you like non-stop hunger. But yeah, some worlds can have weird effects, like really, really weird effects, and that makes this mod extremely cool. The fact that you can also modify your worlds to your liking, and that's oh my god, that's just the the, the capabilities. They're, they're out of this world. But yeah, there's some bad things that that's milk uh there's some bad things like oh no it's constant nighttime here so there's always going to be mob spawning but that's the case with like most of them anyway so it's not too bad of a downside there's also a lot of men that spawn in here uh can they get up here to me i don't think those scrubbies can get up here to me ah there's one right there nice okay let's fly over this one see what pages we get uh there's a good amount of pages in there right now what i'm looking for like the most popular one and also the one that oh, what the did one try and generate on top of the other? What? Oh my god, that's cool. The one I'm looking for, and it's one of the best one, is the, uh... Shit. I'm out of here. The 
the one that generates dense ores which means that the underground is just a bunch of ores and it's really good uh who's calls me blindness right now i need to stop at least creatures don't despawn normally huh tnt part might as well take it about to catch her capture this dude where you at huh where you at dude fight me gotcha who's who's doing the explosions There's someone underground. Oh, there's someone underground. Hey, this guy. I'm gonna go after this guy. These guys right here, even though they're really sh strong, well, they're not really. Yeah, they're kind of strong. Let's see if I can find them. They can also drop some really good items, so let's be careful here. Get him, get him. Oh. No, 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 get me out of here. Uh. They can, all, they can drop a, a gun, and that's what I was trying to get from him. A gun? I think a shotgun is what they can drop. Alright, let's check out this uh, bottom one first. The actual, like, non-broken one. Uh, let's get a block out. You can fucking keep that jail, isn't it? I don't want that guy. I just got that guy out of the way. Okay. Oh, this one isn't that bad, either. This one could have been messed up to where we didn't get any pages, but no, it's perfectly fine. Uh, okay, so, let's check this out. So, we got the pages right here. Cave world? No, okay. Uh, accelerated Accelerated? I don't know what Accelerated does I think Accelerated might just give you speed boost in the world Okay, world Now, you may be like, oh, that's it? That's not that much There is actually a chest you can find in the corner uh, here's one So if you just break this and get the chest and get Frost Forest Biome Double Length Tiny Biome Distribution Bright Lightning I said Bright Lightning or Lightning? Bright Lightning Ice Block Bright lighting might be a good one to have in a cave world. Maybe not in cave world, but what we're going for. What am I doing? Uh, we also got some silver coins from that dude. But yeah, here we should get some more spontaneous explosions. That one's not that good. Scorched surface, not that good. Ender Starfield. I don't know what that means, but it sounds cool. Is there any chests? Nah, no chests from this one. But yeah, oh wait, is that another one? No, it's just messed up. There's some... Hey, that's a uh, that special type of glowstone. My inventory is extremely full. We don't need a TNT minecart. I don't even know why I got this. Can I place this? I don't think I can. Let's just throw it out then. Uh, all right, let's head over here. Check out this mysterious liquid real quick. And uh, hopefully we can find some more. Because I really, really want that dense ores one. This is, uh, this is... Like something glowstone. I don't know what it's called. Energized glowstone? Where's the source? Yeah, energized glowstone bucket. This stuff? Oh man, we can actually use this stuff. I'm gonna waypoint this. Energized glowstone. Alright, I'm gonna do a jump cut here. See if I can uh, find some things and I'll be right back. Okay, so I see one in the distance. I didn't even see that one in the distance. I just wanted to record me going in here, but hey, since there's one right there, might as well go to it. But here, Another structure. Oh god. Black. Is another structure? I mean, a lot of inversion. Holy shit. Uh, is it inversion or inner, inner, inner vision? I don't even know. Ender lilies. Those are completely useless. Alright, everything in there was useless. Uh, I saw some over here. A bunch of endermen. Can we go fight them? I kind of want to fight them. Yeah, let's go fight them. Might as well. Give me them ender pearls. Ender pearls are always nice to have. Enderman. It's weak. Yeah, give me them ender pearls. This is gonna help. Uh, because ender pearls are some that I'm always lacking. Let's have like an enderman farm or something. But yeah, let's go check out this other miscraft little library. What's this called? Like a ruined library? Lost library? I don't even know. Uh, but let's head into it. See if we can get some some dope pages. Where's the entrance? Other side. Right? Nope. Entrance is right here. How convenient. Jeez, move. Okay. <clears throat> what do we got here? We got us a lightning. Amplify normal world. Scorch surface. Dense ore. <gasps> Yo, we got the dense ores. Oh my god, we get two of them? Why are they different numbers? Why don't they stack? What? Uh, oh, here's the chest. 
Bam, give me that. Cherry Blossom Grove. Biofuel blocks. What? Coal ore blocks. Precacia biome. Oh, Precacia. <laughs> we can get the we can get Precacia. Look at that. That's dope. Uh oh. Actually, that is pretty dope. So I have an idea when it comes to doing this quest because we couldn't do this Bam Bam quest because we didn't have uh, the resources. Well, not resources. We didn't have the hunter level to fight the owl sword. But I know a way we can bypass that. I'm just like thinking, should we bypass that? Is there really a point to bypass it? Or should we just like wait patiently? But if we do, if we wait patiently, that means we're not gonna finish. We're not gonna be doing any quests anytime soon if we wait. So I might just do this thing uh, that I'm talking about. And the thing I'm talking about is uh, just making an autonomous activator and then just find one of the Iosaur dens. But using the autonomous activator to do damage to the aisle. So is that or do the... Ooh, actually, I don't think that'll work either. I think we actually, like, 100% need the hunter level to do anything. So, uh, I don't know. But yeah, let's go see if we can make a dense ore thing. And, uh, that might end off the episode. It's not even really cool. Uh, what the heck? That might end off the episode with that. Just because, uh, I want to see if we can get a quarry started with dense ores and uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit okay so we're back chewing gum oh so you might hear like but we are back here we got a world finally it took me a couple tries because I kept on getting garbage worlds and I also got this one that uh, I kept on dying in <laughs> like constantly like well not really I kept on dying but what, what, what was happening in the world was so laggy that like I couldn't do anything so I had to figure uh, slowly get out. It was, it was lagging, but it was playable. Barely. But it was a whole lot of lightning and thunder going on here. We got like poisonous rain going on. But you know, under an overhang, I should be safe. And uh, we don't need anything too fancy to set up a quarry. Uh, got the accumulator. So let's start with that. Uh, what do we need? Let's do this. This should work. Maybe we should move it over. Let's move it over to here. Just because. Okay, so now if we do this. We'll get this on there and then. Well, maybe we should drop this down a block. Let's drop both these down a block. Because I want the quarry to be. Do I have my jetpack? I want my quarry to be right here. So we go like that. Quarry, blah, blah, blah. blah, blah. Okay, uh, four chunks loaded, no problem. So now we do this. Get the accumulator. Bam. Now I can make this a lot better when it comes to how the quarry when it comes to how the quarry is set up right now. Not gonna. Because it's nice and simple, and I like it like that. Uh, so we'll stick to what is nice and simple. And what I like. Okay? Okay. So bam. Set up chest. Probably should get more pipes. Can I make one of these pipes? I don't think I can. I don't think I got the materials to make another one. Another set of them. I can probably just run back to the world though. Uh, but let's go over here and make this chest. There we go. Now we throw in the coal. And we shall activate the quarry. And there it goes. Oh god. Let me just move the gum. In my mouth, that sounds like such a hard task, doesn't it? Uh, Jenny, I don't know, I haven't seen any structures. There's a whole lot of, this is like a, over here, where those purple plants out are, those are called the Heathland, where the purple, purple trees are too. And that's in, just like in other savannah. There's an elecane there, multiple elecanes, and uh, there's ramheads and stuff, so that's nice to know. But I don't even think we will need anything with this troll basher axe like that's really the only thing i wanted from smash these guns are okay but i don't think i want too many guns from the overworld I'm scared i want to go mine coal but i oh, there's some coal right here some honk some noise is going on i think i was honking i couldn't even tell Ooh. oh it sounds like a fire truck okay uh a bunch of coal just so we can keep this place fueled but yeah we should be on ending this episode off here but it took me like 20 minutes before i came back because i'm like oh my god why am i 
why is this so laggy? I can't do anything. And I came back, figured it out, how to get out of there. And if we are all good, don't get hit by the poison rain. This rain does more than just poison. This rain, like, violates you. It's terrible. Gives you hunger. I don't think it gives you nausea, but it gives you poison hunger. And then gives mining fatigue. Let's see if we get hit by it. Ah! Look at this. That's insane. Why does it gotta be so poisonous? Okay. So I believe this quarry will stay active like this. I might bring a, uh... Bring a... What's it doing right now? Is it still sending up the pipes? Maybe I should help it out. Yeah, I'm ending this episode off here. I'll see you guys next episode. The episode might have been short. Oh, poor horse, man. <laughs>